Alright, we're here. Robert's here. We're all here. Heroes change, ready to go fishing. Take down some of our stuff. It was a nice smooth ride. Yeah, I would take it though. I wouldn't leave it here in the car. Yeah, just take it. Check out this boat. ready? Oh, we're ready. It's been a while, Rob. It really I has. Know. Too long. Too long. I agree. Come on, hero. Looking good, y'all. That's what it looks like. We don't know what kind of fish, of course, right? What, what's your best guess? Um, some kind of snappers. Nero, that's all lionfish. Can you imagine? Paradise for you. You like it's lionfish? Yeah, it's the white fish. The white meat fish. Yeah, yeah, one of the best. Let's see what happens. This is how it's done, guys. You guys haven't seen Jeremy for dinner, which I know all you've got. Yeah, look at that. Check him out. Jeremy for dinner. He's grown him a little dad gut since the last time I got to see you guys. Hey, by the way, that's in right now. Dad bod. Yeah. You gotta that's keep good. that. <laughs> all right. How deep is this water, Rob? Um, we'll be about 80. 80. 80. And you're taking a tank down there. What are you going to be looking for? Lobster, lionfish, grouper, snapper, cobia. Anything edible, maybe even a big yellow jack, one of my favorite fish to eat. Okay, nice, nice. Hold this for a second, hero, please. Hero, you don't want to join him, come on. You'll learn as you go down, I promise. It'll be a quick lesson. Going down is the easy part. Coming back up is what you got to pay attention to. <laughs> Very true. Okay, you guys. I'm locked, cock, ready to rock. I'm on a seafood mission. See you guys in a minute. There he goes. He's home. He's home. Go to the GoPro. GoPro. <laughs> yeah. Take a look at this, Hiro-san. <laughs> yes. How are you? Uh, good afternoon, everyone. Good afternoon to yeah, you. I got a little Santa. Might you can you guys can tell? Yeah, right? you guys can probably tell though. You're a little bit red. We were on the boat yesterday with Rob yeah. from Dermy for dinner. Mm -hmm. What a fantastic, fantastic yeah. guy. 
His information on the channel is down below and in the description box. Mm -hmm. He is a man. He's probably spent more time on the water doing YouTube videos than anyone else. Yesterday, Harold, we went to see him. You said, what did you want? You wanted... I was asking to him to catch the lionfish. Right. And uh, lobster. Right. But finally, we got the five lionfish and the one big snapper. Right. Yeah. Huge snapper, which you'll mm -hmm. see on his channel. Anyway, Heroes on today's video sponsored by Galanz. And take a look at this. This is a huge air fryer, eight quart. It's got presets, digital touch display, large capacity, non stick coating. Here, let's see what it does. Yes, look at this. So, take a look at this. There are eight preset cooking functions air fry, grill, slow cook, roast, steam, sous vide, saute, and it makes rice. Take a look at these pictures. And let's look at the technical stuff real quick. Yeah. It's got an air fry lid, it has a non-stick coating, brushed stainless steel housing, which complements any kind of kitchen decor. You have here air fry basket, sous vide and steam rack. You have a grill grate, digital touch display, and you have the glass lid ID. Here's on, this can replace so many different things. This might be a one-stop shop. We're gonna be playing with a little bit more, but mm. in the meantime, we have a very special recipe here, on. What are we making today? Lionfish. Lionfish, yeah, right? I got some uh, from uh, yesterday fishing. Yeah. Right away, you got a, a couple extra. So let's try it here. Let's do an unboxing real yeah. quick. Okay. All right, Hero. We got this air fryer out already. Mm. This is what it looks like, unboxed. Let's go through what it looks like on the inside. So this here is actually an air fry basket. It sits in there. And this is the top that goes on top of that. Mm -hmm. Hero, can you lift that up? Let's get one better look at that. It's got the fan here. It's got a heating element. And of course, your this is plug. This connecting to here. Exactly. Plugs into there, and it's going to be somewhat water resistant and waterproof. What's well, going to block out as much water as it can. This tray here is actually for sous vide or steamer. And this is a grill. So now, let's take a look at the line fish. Again. Beautiful, beautiful fish and the most delicious sashimi. Mm. All right, here, oh, let's go through the ingredients. Okay? Yes, of course, uh, lionfish is sitting here. Yeah, take a look at this. Yep. Beautiful fish. All right, here, what else? Then, first thing I'm gonna do, attach the cornstarch on that fish, right? And the might I'm gonna use for the sauce too. So, I have a ginger here, and scallion, and sliced garlic, and sambar, sesame oil, sake, mirin, soy sauce, and this is a soup stock. And uh, I already sliced up the ginger here. And this is a salt and pepper mix. Okay, perfect. All right, Hiroshima, what is the first step? First step, I'm gonna slice up to lionfish. Okay, and let's tell the audience also, you cleaned it already because you don't want to leave the guts in there too long. Yeah, I, I just uh, take all the guts out last night. Okay, we return. So okay, perfect. Ready to the preparation. All right, so I'm going to use this uh, biggest one okay. for today. And then usually, of course, you know, th this fish has a uh, very uh, sharp spine and this is uh, has a poison. So normally f either you're going to cut off fast or a little bit more like a longer knife to, you know, avoid into right. touching this one. Okay. But you guys can take a look. Here, can you hold the fish up? I want to just show the audience also. You guys can see these are venomous. What happens is that... That's where the poison comes out of, and they have the, mm. the, 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 the venomous glands down here below. And as you can see, when Robert went to catch these, they're okay with him being up close. They have no known predators, and they just hang out until surprise, mm. catch them, spear them, actually. All right, here. So we're going to do the spines on for so, so today, display. So uh, today, as of your request, <laughs> I'm going to leave, leave these things, okay? Yeah, yeah. So... Um, I need to uh, be very be careful to handling this fish because my knife is uh, not too uh, long as like a robot okay. has it, you know. Okay, so um, actually I'm gonna put a little guideline in here because uh, when you start to eat, easy to take all the meats out. So that's why I'm gonna put the guideline here. And then, might you guys remember, I made that uh, whole fish video last time. I got, I actually I cut this way. Uh, opening this way, right? Right. So today I'm gonna do uh, pretty much uh, fish sitting this way. Okay. Right. So I'm gonna open this is kind of butterfly open the way. Okay. And anyway, I'm gonna do light, just a little bit to guide the line here too. 
because th this is a very easy to take off the meats out after you know when you eat okay from here to all the way to here I'm just gonna all the way into the half like that like that open it like this okay, okay. one side the other side same way just put a little guideline then I'm gonna do from here to and now if you guys can't find line fish get some get a whole snap or something but try this recipe last time when here did it inside the kitchen of Novi Beautiful dish, yes. you guys probably saw that. So uh, I'm looking for. And you use a deep fryer, right? So this is. Yeah, that was kind a of deep fryer. Yeah. Coming like this, open. Like okay. That. Okay. And then this thing was gonna be stay too. So, so let's see. Then, um, then just idea to uh, sit into the uh, air fryer. I want to really stay. Uh, this way, you know. Right. So of course, you know, while you're cooking, that's gonna be my do how they call filing down. Yeah, yeah, I might fall over. So I'm gonna use uh, daikon radish, I'm gonna attach into into the stomach. Right? Okay. So that in that case is gonna be stay more stronger. So maybe make it uh, like a stand. Yeah, right? stand stand, yeah. So this daikon we're not gonna eat. Just right. for the, the attachment to, to stand in these things, you know. So I'm not gonna eat these things. Let me see. It's gonna be stay or not? Probably this way, right? Like that. Okay, that it works, works, huh? It does stay more, right? Alright. Okay. Okay, first I'm gonna do the salt and pepper. This is already mixed already. I'm gonna attach it to a little bit here. Okay. Okay, that's good. Then uh, next one is a cornstarch. Mix with the water already. Usually, if you go into the deep fryer with the oil, I'm gonna do, um, of course, the powder one. You know. Yeah, dry, right? Yeah. So in this case, yeah, fryer. So I'm just gonna attach this one. Cornstarch is going to give a nice crisp coating on yeah, it. Yeah, I'm looking for yeah, so the little right. um, crunchiness. Yeah, you know. crunchiness, right? It should Absolutely. be the dry, uh, air fryer is going to make it everything uh, nicely uh, crunchiness, you know? Yeah. Uh, but just uh, this kind of trial. Uh, okay, that's good. At least, you know, this is not going to burn out. I'm okay for that, you know? Okay, so. So now I'm gonna do, yeah, yeah actually this one, I'm gonna put in this one in, into the air fryer. Yeah? Yep. So far, it's good. So far, so good. It's sitting pretty well there. Okay, right. here. Okay, I'm just gonna close down, then I come up to your side. Uh, 360 and 25 minutes, I guess. This one. Yep. Okay. Um, you guys can't see that, but it says 360 on the left. Maybe you can, 25. Okay, perfect. And there you go. And heat, that's it. And let the magic happen. We'll be back in 25 minutes. Good luck. Hero-san? Yeah. It's going to come on nice. I'll be right back. Air fry is almost ready. You guys see the steam coming out. Right now, it shows 360 degrees again still at three more minutes to go. So, we have no idea what it's going to be the result. It's already beeping. Yeah. Is it ready? Wow. Wow, came out pretty nice, hero. Yeah. Take a look at that. Oh yeah. Okay, let's start to make a sauce. All right, this is Hero's magical sauce. Yeah. My favorite, you guys can learn this, try it. You guys will be amazed how good this thing tastes. Trust me when so I tell you. I heard about uh, you were using also this wok too. I use the wok too in my house. <laughs> <laughs> I 
put that little oil. Somehow my food doesn't come out the way yours is. Just taste, girl. The first thing is uh, garlic. Okay. And the ginger. I wanna know. Slowly cook. First. Okay, and then scallion. The more like the white parts of the scallion. Okay. Garlic, ginger, and scallion. This is like a full now. The most important ingredients in Asian cooking. Then, actually, I'm gonna add a little bit of spiciness sambar here. Okay. And the, uh, this is a uh, soup stock, just a little bit. Okay. You can uh, add the bamboo shoot also, this one. Oh, I love bamboo shoot. Love great bamboo combination. Shoot. Okay, this is a meeting. And then, of course, soy sauce. Then I'm gonna quick little bit tasting. Mm. How's it? Is it spicy Perfecto. at all? A little bit uh, spicy side. Okay. Then today I'm gonna use uh, the same cornstarch, right? Yes. Yeah. Same cornstarch. But same cornstarch. You use a brush that fish. Add in here to thicken it up. And that's add it slowly, just so yeah, thickens up pretty quick. You don't want it too lumpy. Uh, last moment, I'm gonna put a little bit of sesame oil. That's it. Cut off the heat. Ready. Okay. So right, here, oh. Let's take a look at this. This sauce I'm gonna do at the top. Oh wow. That looks amazing, huh? Mm. Looks good, looks good. Okay, look at this beautiful line fish that Hero just cooked with that air fryer, the Galanz air fryer. Thank you so much for them for yeah. sponsoring today's video. We're definitely going to make more things with it. Can't wait to try it. Suve, saute, and also the grill. This is definitely a success, but we're going to try in just a minute. If you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up, comment below, share it. Don't forget to subscribe and Hero san We'll see you soon. Yep. Thank you very much. See you next time. Thank you. To the best part of all, hero. Are you ready? This is one tasting I am so looking forward to. Okay. Enjoy. Take a this side. Oh yeah, I could just eat the ginger and scallion and and garlic. That's all I would need, huh? Yeah. Maybe we just steam rice. Oh yeah. Okay, this one. Look at this. Look at this. Amazing. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> How's arrow? I know one of your favorite fish is the lionfish. Sashimi is good, but the grill is another good thing. Right? This air fryer style. Oh my goodness, take a look. And they're not a little they're not a lot of little bones, which is another great thing. Let's have a big piece here. Take a look at that. Mmm. Wow. Mm. That is delicious. The ginger and scallion always works. Of course, with your garlic and a little bit of soy sauce, sesame oil, and the other stuff you use like mirin, and the broth. But let me tell you, with that fish, and this is a little kick from the sambal now, 
Mm-hmm. It is absolutely delicious. This fish is phenomenal. Still very, very moist. Not dry at all. So we can break off another piece. Here, break off another piece on mm-hmm. the other side. Let's show them. This air fry did wonders. Look how the meat is. It's just very, very soft. You guys can see it at all. It just flakes off like that. Still steamy, you see it? Right here? Mm-hmm. Oh my goodness, this is heaven. Amazing, huh? <laughs> so, so good. Mm. You guys have to try this recipe. Trust me, you can find lionfish, find something else at your, your fresh supermarket, seafood anywhere. We are definitely do this again. Enjoy, hero. Mm. Thank you very much. Thank you.